uh, I'm Nick Bragg from Frogmere Green Farm and we're a leaf demonstration farm. Uh, our soils uh, here at Frogmere are a real great asset uh, to our farming business. Uh, we use integrated farm management as a tool to uh, manage uh, our farming business. Uh, here at Frogmere we've always had an issue with soil erosion um, and we've put in a number of measures um, over the past years um, with soil management to try and reduce the impact of, of erosion. Um, the field we're in at the moment um, is a, a we class as a sandy clay loam, um, very free draining, um, very good workable um, soils for crops, um, free draining and um, giving very good root structure as well. As well as introducing minimal tillage, uh, we've swapped to uh, green cover crops to help erosion. Um, this particular crop that we've got in here is, is winter oats that was put in behind maize um, just to stop and cover bare soils over winter. Uh, with our chicken business, uh, we use the litter um, to spread on our land. Um, and again, that, that's great organic matter to build up um, into the soils. In addition to our overall soil management, we've put in, put in some additional measures uh, to help soil erosion. In this particular instance, we've put in filter fences uh, as a short-term measure. The field we put it in is uh, named Crooklyn Walls. It's got on a slight gradient and where we put it we've uh, found a, a fantastic result from this temporary fence. Uh, the filter fence was erected uh, at the end of November and we dug in uh, a small proportion of, of the uh, fence under the ground, um, about 8 inches, and then erected uh, stakes and we chose to make a, a slight uh, V or diamond shape um, to try and slow the water down rather than having it in a straight line. Um, we also put two barriers up as well, um, again just trying to stop and slow the water in its uh, travelling course. And we're thrilled how it's worked. We reduced our soil erosion significantly um, with the use of filter fences and also with integrated farm management. Roy Hayes, Catchment Sensitive Farming Officer for the Tone and Parrot Catchments. Uh, we've been working with Frogmary Green Farm for a number of years now. Um, hoping to address uh, soil uh, erosion and runoff, uh, particularly in this catchment, Glanbrook, which is failing uh, the Water Framework Directive status for phosphate. And over the years, we've done a number of uh, visits and many events, helping others and also with Frog Mary to, to address these issues. We're currently demonstrating uh, sediment filter fencing in this catchment. Uh, Frog Mary Green is one of the number of sites we're using this. Um, it's made of a geotextile mesh which helps to trap water and soil and phosphates and it's working very well and across the catchment it's, it's proven very successful. Uh, so CSF has funded the fencing here and um, the farm farmer itself has put, has put the fencing in. Um, this has worked very well. Um, the actual material and process has been used in a number of sites in the construction industry. It's been very effective and it's now proven very effective in the agricultural industry.